If you're searching for the best personalized nootropic supplements on the market, you only have two serious options, Thesis or Nootopia. But while both brands offer personalized nootropics, their products cannot be more different. So which brand offers the best personalized nootropics for your needs? Let's find out. Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. My name is Greg Gostinkar and I'm the founder of Your Inception. If biohacking, nootropics and optimizing brain performance interest you, then subscribe below and join our amazing community. Let's compare Thesis and Nootopia, two personalized nootropics brands known for their outstanding nootropics techs. We're going to talk about the similarities, differences, my experience with both brands, effects, safety, and finally, I'm going to share with you which is the better brand for you. First, let's talk about Thesis. Now, Thesis is a New York supplement brand that currently offers about six different types of personalized nootropic stacks designed to boost their brain performance, motivation, energy, clarity, creativity, etc. To get your personalized stack, you first need to take a quiz, then you get a starter kit, which is similar for most people. And after you try a few different formulas, their coach that you get for free will help you optimize the stacks for you. Nootopia, on the other hand, is a sub-brand of BioOptimizers, the famous US supplement brand. They have developed multiple nootropic stacks, not only for brain performance, but also to reduce stress and anxiety and to help you calm down. You also have to take the quiz, but instead of getting a starter kit, you already get the best stacks designed for your individual needs. Now, in theory, both brands offer a very similar solution, but the reality shows quite a different picture. Now, before we talk about the important differences between the products, let's check out what both brands and products have in common. Firstly, both brands are known for developing quality products. If quality is super important to you, then whatever brand you go with, you are in good hands. Now, the second similarity is that both brands have developed a lifestyle quiz. So based on your answers, I assume that a simple algorithm chooses the right stack or combinations of supplements for you. Now, my team and I have developed a similar brain assessment that is way more accurate than just a simple lifestyle questionnaire. By the way, there's a link below. And sometimes even that is not enough to give an accurate recommendation. So while having a quiz is beneficial, I think that if you really want to get the best personalized nootropics, then answering the quiz is definitely not enough. Now, the third similarity is that none of the brands actually offers completely personalized nootropics. What they've done is they have developed a few pre-made stacks a few different products, and then they give you a combination of those. So you won't get a completely personalized capsule that is unique just to you, but what you will get is a pre-made product that other people who answer the quiz similarly will get as well. That's just the reality. Now let's have a look at the differences. First and foremost, Nootopia delivers way stronger effects than Thesis. It is actually really hard to compare the products in terms of the short-term effects because Nootopia is like a spaceship that will launch you into the orbit and this is feels more like a moderately fast car. However, in terms of the long-term effects, you have no idea where Nootopia is going to take you and what's going to happen with you, whereas with Thesis, you can be sure you're in safe hands, moving directly to your goal. Now, having made this analogy, if you need a supplement to cover your monthly peaks, which means you will take the product now and then, then Nootopia is the product for you. But if you're searching for a long-term brain booster that will help you on your long journey, then Thesis is the product for you. The second difference is the transparency, and that's a big one. Thesis is very straightforward in exposing their exact product formulas, so you know exactly which nootropics you're taking, how much of those, and why. Nootopia, on the other hand, is quite different. You don't know the exact formula that you'll get, what are the dosages of nootropics in the formula, etc. Now, they claim each formula is different, so it's impossible to make a label for every person. But as I reveal in this video up here, this is unlikely to be true. So, in terms of the transparency, Thesis is a clear winner here. Now, how about the safety? While Thesis contains some of the most well-known nootropics, the dosages are within the recommended levels, and generally, you don't take more than 10 to 15 nootropics daily, even if you combine two different formulas. Now, based on my experience, which you can watch up here, Thesis is a very safe product that doesn't really cause any adverse side effects. But that's not really the case with Nootopia. Nootopia contains lots of different nootropics in unknown dosages. They also contain potentially problematic combinations of racetams, which they hide under the name Omnipept. By the way, racetams are illegal to use without a prescription in many countries, or they're in the so-called gray area in others, so they are quite problematic. Because of that, 
Not only is the safety of Notopia questionable, especially if you'll take it daily for months or years, but I have experienced a really strong headache with one of their formulations, so you need to be more careful with Notopia. So overall, Thesis is much safer, so it's 3-1 for Thesis. By the way, guys, if you like this video, please press the like button below and subscribe to my channel. Now, how about the pricing? Thesis costs $119 for one-time purchase, but if you subscribe, you will get a monthly dosage of brain nutrients for about $79, give or take. Natopia, on the other hand, offers different packages. The most affordable one starts at $97 if you subscribe, and the most expensive one called World Domination is $349 if you subscribe. The most affordable one contains four dosages per week, or as they like to say it, you have four no bad days each week, whereas the most expensive contains a dosage of various nootropics for every day. So in terms of pricing, Thesis is way more affordable than Nootopia. How about the variety of stacks? Nootopia contains not only stacks for brain performance, but also stacks that will help you calm down, reboot, and recover. Thesis currently contains only stacks for performance, so here Nootopia is better. And how about my overall experience and feeling? Now, I have tested both products for quite some time, and to be honest, I love Thesis transparency, and I feel way more comfortable taking their supplements because I know exactly what I'm taking. Now, for long-term use, I think Thesis blows Nootopia away. But in terms of an occasional use, for example, if I'm having a really bad day and I need this strong brain boost, Nootopia is so more potent that I will absolutely take one of their combos instead of Thesis. Now, since I think all supplement brands should be transparent and they shouldn't use borderline marketing strategies to sell their products, like Nootopia does, I give another point to Thesis. It just makes me feel better and I trust the brand more than Nootopia. So what does that all mean? Now, if you look at the score, Thesis is a clear winner and I'm happy it is. They offer a few great formulations, they're 100% legit a brand, they don't make things up and I have no problem recommending their formulas to my friends. Nootopia is a bit more sketchy. Their marketing strategies are on the borderline, their products are barely legal, and without exposing their formulas, you have no idea if what you're taking is actually safe for you. So because of that, I have a really hard time recommending Nootopia to my friends. But in terms of the short-term effects, Nootopia is a clear winner here, and I personally do take their supplements a few times per month when I need a really strong energy boost because once you find the right combo, it's going to blow your mind. Well, not quite literally, I hope, but still. So if you want to try Thesis or Nootopia, there are some links and some discount codes below. All right, guys, tell me, which brand do you prefer more and why? I really want to hear your opinion. Oh, and if you're searching for the best Nootropic stacks of this year, check out my video up here. Thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you soon again. Stay well.